Hello to all my viewers. This is Dr. Tawal Mehta and today I'll explain how to run support vector machine predictor in Nine. Support vector machine is a powerful and widely used machine learning algorithm that is used for both classification and regression problems. STM is a discriminative algorithm that separates the data points into different classes by constructing a hyperplane or a set of hyperplanes in a high dimensional space. SVM works, works by finding the optimal hyperplane that maximizes the margin between the two classes, with the margin being the distance between the hyperplane and the closest data points from each class. The goal of the SVM is to find a line that can separate these two classes with the maximum margin possible. The margin is defined as the distance between the line and the closest data points from each class. The optimal hyperplane is the one that has a maximum margin. In some cases, it may not be possible to separate the data points with a sep simple separate line. In such cases, SVM can use thermal functions to transform the data points into higher dimensional space, where they become separable. SVM can use various types of kernels such as linear, polynomial, and radial basis fun function kernels. Let's try to understand how the objective of SVM. We are having two classes, plus and minus. We want to separate these classes with the help of the hyperplane. So we will pick up the nearest two supporting vector, that is a plus here and minus here. We will pass a plane in such a way that this separate the plus and minus. We want to maximize this hyperplane. This, this distance is known as a margin. The points which are used for creating the hyperplane are known as, are known as a supporting vectors. We want to increase the increase this distance as far as possible. Now, how we can run this? Let's see in nine. I'll activate the input output from here. Now I'll double click on it and browse the data set. I'll connect heart one, right click on it and execute. Now, again, right click on it and see the file table. I want to do the classification of the heart disease on the basis of age, resting blood pressure, cholesterol, and maximum hours of exercise. So I'll activate the column filter from here so that I can only include those variables which are necessary for us. Right click on it and configure. So I'll include age, resting blood pressure, cholesterol, maximum hours of exercise, and heart disease. Click OK. Right click on it and execute. Now activate the SVM Learn. I request all my viewers to kindly refer my previous video so that you can understand the flow of this tutorial. Configure. Make sure that the heart disease is our target variable. Don't change any default settings. These settings are for the kernels. So if you want to uh, segregate the two planes in the high dimension, then only you should go for polynomial, hypertangent, or radial basis function. Click OK. Now activate the SVM predictor from here. So this predictor will get its learning from SVM learner. Now click on the support vector and predictor configure. Make sure that you check these boxes. Click OK. Now it will require the data set. So connect this data set here. Right click on it and execute. Again, right click on it and you can see the classification. So this is a prediction according to the algorithm. And this is the original data set. So this is the way you can run SVM predictor in Nine. For more videos on Nine, kindly subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on LinkedIn and Twitter. Please refer my playlist in which I have already uploaded many videos on Nine.